Number one, massage your hair and use derma roller or head massages such as these to stimulate blood circulation and healthy scalp. Number two, find your hair porosity, low, medium or high. This is so important. Number three, hair oiling. Once or twice a week, implement a hair oiling as part of your hair routine. Make sure that you don't leave it overnight and you always, always wrap your hair to protect it from dust and other dirt during the hair oiling. Just leave it for a few hours and then wash as normal. Number four, apart from rosemary oil and rosemary water that we've all heard about a million times, use vitamin E. Vitamin E is so good. It will protect your hair and it will make it so soft and shiny so you won't regret it use vitamin e and i know this is an obvious one but number five is limit heat so try to style your hair using heatless tools whether it will be straight or curly try to use tools and there's ton of them on the market that will not apply heat to your hair so it will be able to grow healthier and I'll give you a bonus one. To make sure that your hair looks healthy and good from the back, make sure that you trim it often enough because sometimes we tend to leave the hair grow and it grows and then there's a disproportion between the top, the middle and the ends. So the ends should always be trimmed often enough so the hair looks full and healthy.